Okay, here we go. Uh, this was the guy. He was a creator of Akara, like some kind of macro, micro, micro biologic guy, or oh, yeah, some kind of a maybe related. I don't know. Fucking hell. He's he's the eventual the creator of and Akira, uh, Akara. Yeah, Akara androids basically. <laughs> oh, so, yeah. Welcome to the Red String Club. So this is the infamous the red string joint, huh? My name's Edgar. Our mutual friend Larissa texted me telling me to come here. Yeah, the Larissa. The party woman. The woman who likes to party every now and basically like every week, I will say. I just happened to be in the neighborhood so I figured I'd drop by before joining her for some fun. She spoke highly of your cocktails, man. Ah, uh -huh. yeah. This is my number one patron. My name is Donovan. Pleased to meet you. Cool. Okay, first thing first. Is that the Akara Android you are wasting as a greeting machine? Uh, I... I didn't know they introduced them to the public already. Hmm, not exactly. But you could consider this some sort of close set beta. Cool! Do you mind if we have them join the conversation? Um, I don't know if that's good. Yes, father. I programmed them all to address me as father. Haha. <laughs> I guess I'm compensation for my lost semen dispenser. Okay. <laughs> Alright. I wonder does this guy has also upgrade some kind of because he has a, those like a boots. Or or actually they look like no actually they are not boots. They are I think they are part of like uh, his eventual like a leg or maybe like a part of cult I don't know. I wonder what are those some kind of upgrades or something. Uh, uh, okay, what is the mirror Nero algorithm? What role does Akara play in all this? Why is Super... Okay, Supercontinent doing this here. Is this legal? Is the government aware of this? Who is Supercontinent CEOs? Okay, I have to find those out. I guess I'm compensating for my loss. Sim dispenser, yeah. Hmm, sure. You had many beautiful children. Congratulations. Thanks, dude. How's Akara been doing so far? Are you happy with their performance? Akara is amazing, way beyond my expectations. Their empty... Their empathy is of the charge superhuman. In no time they adapted to my work style. They've been really helpful and supportive. You should be proud of Akara. Thank you. It makes me happy to hear that. Thank you. Wow, that's great to know. I was afraid that all that education supercontent putting them through at the clinic may ruin their nature. Education? As in schooling them? No, as in teaching them the corpse philosophy. Ah. It's all the idea of the new CEO. Quite ironic if you think about how she was trained. Will you mind telling me more about the new CEO? Hmm, that's delicate issues. I read a talk about my stuff. Sure, what's your stuff? They're mirror neuron algorithm, baby. I spent ages trapping in the lab, keeping safe to it, and now I can't wait for people to know its wonders. Sounds exciting. You bet. Although, I gotta say, I'm a bit disappointed you haven't offered me a drink yet. Of course, how rude of me. Let me put something together for you. By the way, no tequila please, my body doesn't really deal well with it. Hmm, that complicates things a bit, but gotcha. Panini... Fraud. Panini tea. Hmm.
Oh. Oh no, yeah, we have to put more. Hold on. Yeah. Let's do that. Hmm. Everything alright? Yes. It's just that this ring is so damn good. You're so true, Donovan. You are so authentic. Nice, thank you. You don't have to be so solemn about it. Nah, I'm sorry. It just got me thinking about what I'm be doing all these years. Anyway, is there something you want me to talk about? Hmm. Any thoughts on the super content new direction? I don't know. Whatever it is, I hope they still count on me in the future. Not sure if I'll be up to the task for what they got planned. Your philosophies don't align anymore? I won't say that. Maybe the problem is that I never had a philosophy or vision to begin with. I mean... Yeah, oh, you didn't have like any like a... You like any like idea about what you're gonna use like a... Your... Uh, I mean, you created Akara and you created the... Minor... Minor... What was they call it? M and A... Uh, M and A... Program, so I guess you didn't have any long-term vision, but you wanted to like be part of it, I guess, to create because for fun, I guess. I've been lucky; my work has been useful to them, but I don't see myself having any more world-changing ideas. I mean, let's be realistic: Agara and the Mirror Neuron algorithm. Oh yeah, it was Mirror Neuron algorithm. I pushed my luck too far in the science department, <clears throat> if you ask me. I still don't quite believe it myself that I got to contribute such marvelous to the world. And there's a lot of people mad because of them, so mix it with it. Regardless of what I think of your work, it's undeniably wondrous. And you don't have to worry about people being upset by the MME. Because my friends and I are gonna put a uh, in. Wait a minute. Because my friends and I are gonna put an end to it before it's hit in the market. Oh, Donovan decided to like uh, go pretty solidly in. Ah? Uh, you do that for me? You son of a bitch. They open up to you and you mock me? Ah, uh, sorry. That's too hard to emphasize with the two times senior science for it about the dirt not being the charm. Piss off. Okay. I'm trying to know more about the m e I bet you are. Although I don't feel like I'm ready to talk the talk right now. Oh, come. My head can get a bit, bit of swasquated sometimes. 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 I'm sorry. You know what? Agara here should be able to disclose the basic information. Do you mind, Agara? The mirror neural algorithm is the first program to live and reproduce in human beings. Using implants theories as transmitters, the MNE can broadcast subconscious conditional to implant the free subsystems. This is performed via micro expressions and subtle body language. Given enough, enough exposure, an implant free subject will adopt these patterns. Becoming a new hole for the program. Oh shit, so it's like a parasite. Why didn't you tell me that if you know this all along, Akara? Ha! Don't blame them. We put pretty confidential protocols to on them. <laughs> Only few of us supercontinent can override it. Override them. Damn fucking. So, that's the m in a nutshell. What do, do you, what do you plan to broadcast? 
So she up psych welfare. Oh, it was the social psych welfare with my side thinking. And that's it. Yes. A guy like me shouldn't be calling such like that. And then M N E A is a thing we should toy with. I'm not aware of external of its capabilities myself. Shit, sorry, I'm a bit overwhelmed by all this. How is this even possible? I kinda get how you will control implants viewers, but I don't see myself falling for the micro expression punk. Honestly, I'm not really sure how it works either. I know the psychology background behind it, but biologically speaking, I'm clueless. We did some close gr closer group testing with very basic performance boost algorithm at the lab and it worked. But to the but to code micro expressions into the implant viewers, you need an AI as powerful as Akara. So even if the idea is mine, most of the credit for its extent is Akara's. Wow. Okay, that's interesting. Stone Student becomes the master, huh? Ah, uh, yeah. I'm sure I lose myself to my own creation eventually. Okay, I heard enough. I'm sorry, you're getting all these bad vibes from the MLA. Not that I don't understand why you get all alarmed. I just wish I could put my mind at ease before I leave. For now, I prepare if we move on. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're gonna get another thing. I'm gonna put. Just try to get that vanity somehow. Fuck. Shut up. How's the human being able to grab something this flawless? I may have found my ego, but applied to bartending. I mean, I'm probably the number one scientist alive, probably in all history in two time. But you, my friend, you are the best bartender in this universe chaos has ever given birth to. My most sincere congratulations, you talented son of a bitch. Okay, we have to... Now... We should take a picture together for the... In... The... Enos... 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 What the... Wow, dude. Haha, uh, glad you like it. Okay, I'm back. What shall my briefless intellect... Intellect help you with? Any plans for Agar besides pottery? Any plans for Agar besides pottery? Pottery? That's a ridiculous tiny fraction of Akara potential. Akara could well take on any job, from flipping burgers to directing traffic. Akara could be you, your fucking dentist. You could kill a man, and Akara could conduct the investigation, perform the autopsy, just you in trial, and then officiate the victim funeral. Okay, I get it. I'm gonna go act as a loving mother of thousands of orphans. I'm gonna go this every chapter in the universe. They could even run for fucking president and win. I'm gonna still be the president of the world. Haha, <laughs> president of the world? You are crazy. Wait and see. 
they just need to finally get out there. You remember what I told you about the MNE, don't you? Well, this is why Agara is ideal to handle it. And I'll be pleased to enlighten you about it. Okay, moment of truth. I do Akara and the MNA with together. Okay, first of all, I want to defend my colleague's Diana's work. I feel like you're pretty obst obstinate about seeing uh, social psych welfare as brainwashing. Spare me, she already explained how it's not brainwashing, but accessing our better selves. And I still don't buy it. Tough crowd, huh? What if I told you that with the MNA regulated SPY, SPWE, you won't lose status or race? Started to get sick of these acronyms. This sweet duo object is to create a wonderful, wonderful super factional world. We can fine tune the problem to control only the most extreme effects of those states. The MNA will allow sadness but not depression. <laughs> it allow you to be angry but won't let you get consumed by fat. It allow you to dwell in pleasure but won't permit other hedonies. So it's allowing those things but it doesn't allow to go like a beyond to like a extreme from those like a point. It kinda has its own threshold. Am I going to get your fools to understand that al altering someone's behavior is brainwashing? It's not that extreme. Why are you so against it? Ah, uh, this this all sounds pretty. <laughs> Just let people be depre depressed. I'm not talking about not letting you to have a bad week. You can be as gloomy as you want, but before you fall into clinical depression, the NIA will lift you up. It prevents you from committing murder or suicide. There are uncountable psycho, psycho, psychotherapists in the world already fighting that. What's wrong about simply eradicate it from society? Can we skip to part where you can tell me about Akara? You're m way more obstinate than any of your colleagues. So we better not waste any more of either of our time. So neither of us will change their mind, but I'm the obstinate on one. Ha! Huh. Whatever, get yourself ready for the good part. We do agree that leaving control of the NIE to, the, to a corporation or individual will be unethical, right? Yes. We are in lockdown. We have a vulnerable and ever caring AI which was designed with people happiness in mind. Oh no, yeah, a car. Oh yeah, you can agree with me on this one. You met a car. If there's anyone with enough brain power to assess every person case individually, it's them. A car can study your habits, hobbies, desire, breach this and keep you within your optimal emotional range. I need you to leave now. What? Get out of my bar. Playtime is over. Okay, fuck it. Don't even get really bad. Hi, hon. Oh, you finally made me made, made up your mind. Yeah, I'm all for going at them with all we got. Listen, I'm in the middle of delicate situation here. Good news is that I found COO Johanna Septis. Bad news is that she is about to jump off Northbridge. Jesus. I see what I can do. I got an ace up on my sleeve. Since you asked me to track her down, I asked the Proxima for a back door to her rebel implants. I'm gonna try sending some anti-depress subroutines to tame this kitty. Okay, gotta leave you now, bye. Quite, quite the view, huh? Oh, you, oh yeah, because we 
Yeah, yeah, we implant the fucking, uh, the fucking, uh, uh, put the implant with was say like a, a Proxima on code implant. You pick at a beautiful place to end your life. Out of the blue and yellow squares full of people who don't care about each other. Then a bunch of fools like us who don't want to stop fighting over the right to dictate the way the, they live. I wish it will all disappear into thin air. I need to get closer to keep her from jumping. Frozen her will linger attention, so I should probably talk her down before moving in. Gonna pay attention to her body language. She's too anxious, putting some distance between us will definitely help. I could also hack her in blood to calm her, but I shouldn't abuse this or I could fry her. Fine, let's put some soul into this. Yeah, let's... Okay, we have one seal pulse. Okay, step back, step forward, dialogue. Do you mind me asking why you decided to end it all? I lost my way. I let everyone kick I care about lose their way too. So Perkon did set out to change the world. Money wasn't the reward, but the means to end. Now that object objectives, objectives has been twisted so many times, I can't remember when it was I stopped caring. Yeah, me. Your life could use a new direction then. Yeah, like a uh, what? Uh, if if you like uh, find yourself like a uh, pretty much that you are in the dead and that you try to like pursue something and you got it and you basically accomplished in there what you accomplished and now you feel kind of empty then yeah pursue a new direction or something like uh, that's what I have done. I mean yeah. Your life could use a new direction then. It's a natural for objectives to change their human constructs. Constructs. Yeah, pretty much. And humans will stop changing. That's true. That's true. <coughs> if your vision doesn't align with your company anymore, set yourself free. Yeah, true. Like um... Yeah. Not everything gonna be like the same. You might be like a change in your mind with something, your vision might change, and so on. Yeah, that's normal. Like, okay. Not everything gonna be like the same. I don't see the tragedy in that. It's the other way that being depressing to never mutate. A new direction? Nice, almost stable now. Uh, let's do another dialogue. Northbridge has always been good for getting some perspective. Inside that concrete mate, it's easy to lose your friend in data stream and notifications. Yes. <laughs> we can barely see where we're putting our feet anymore. Hell, I, I dismissed two sets from my brain. Right. So, since we started to talk in. But then being here looking at that rock floating on the ocean, we could just start walking the other way and leave the city behind us, huh? Yeah, like, uh, that's true. Are you making good point? It isn't that easy. Yeah, that's true also. It isn't, it, it never, it's not easy. Yeah, but you bet, you bet. There's too much of ourselves cemented to the foundation of those skyscrapers. Yeah, this is like a true, like, uh, even though, like, uh, you wanna, like, uh, maybe, like, uh, change your life drastically, like, uh, you wanna, like, uh, live, like, a big city or a city itself, maybe, somewhere. It's, uh, it will be very pretty nice, but it's also really difficult. Basically, because a lot of, like, uh, things are, because if you know what the brand is say, yeah, uh, like, uh, there is just too much things to cement it to the foundation itself, so yeah. I know this feeling too. <laughs> yeah, there's just too much things cemented on that. But but think about it. What will you lose? Money, power, responsibility, identity? Yeah, money, uh, power, I don't know about my own power. Responsibility, maybe. Identity, mm, maybe that too. The weight of the 
the weight of the weight of civilization. Ah, uh, yeah, that's too. That too. Yeah, Drew. Eh. Good, she looks stable. I should move closer. Let, let's move in. Hmm, losing her a little now. What's your name? I am, I'm Brandis. Why are you doing this? I need you for taking down supercontinent. Your cons you conscience is killing you because of what the company is trying to pull off, right? We you use your help to fight them, and you get uh, to redeem yourself. I just can't face them. Oh yeah, that was bad. Listen, are you with Proxuma? I'm not part of their organization, but we collaborate in quite often. Must think that I do met this city, right? Yeah, I, this city was doomed long ago. If not supercontinent, it will have been any of many co corps we rebel a few can't keep in check. And if I, if not them, it have been the very citizens of Earth who don't give a fuck about anything beyond their favorite TV shows. TV so eating the planet away, pretty much. You could say that in some way we were all lobotom lobotomized a long time ago. Pretty much like uh, you cannot really like it to anything like uh, when it comes to like a big corporation and many things. Uh, yeah, there is a lot of like uh, those around, and even though you cannot do the do uh, and do anything against them and if they're not existing there gonna be some other things that gonna be like uh, place them so it doesn't matter like if they're gone there's gonna be something new basically rise up and fuck everything up like usual it's just happens basement activist and confabulating with stakeholders are just different ways of killing time before the end that's bleak yeah, uh, outside of railing scares me. One is the other and uh, what other end? But the other is even more terrifying. They on the railing then. That was m a metaphor. I know. They on the railing, life not binary, Johanna. When you set boot on the ground, you don't need to go back to face some sort of redemption or ordeal. Have a hamburger, ride a bike, play a video game. There's a plenty of things more important even than our ridiculous war over civil welfare. Play a video game? God, it has been ages since I last looked into Steam. Ha! Ah! You still play more. Having fun really puts everything else into perspective. Yeah, that's true, like, uh, basically also to me like a... Uh, uh, I I have not have a like a I have a, like a rarely have like a in this like a university apply science like years especially like first and second year I think was like a, one one of the most heaviest ones uh, and I think third year also maybe those three years was most most heaviest one I had a, like a not like a great amount extent time to play video games even though I really wanted to but sometimes I wasn't like a playing like a, even many months so. I think like playing video games uh, now that I have like good balance with my study that I don't need to have many courses that I can find like study specifically and left my time for like my family matters I left time for like a video game matters and maybe like a exercising and other hobbies and yeah especially I like like playing video games because it's putting it's basically putting me easy mode like I, I can relax and then I'd be like a more motivated maybe like a doing a study like a later or or just like a go to sleep after that and it's fun and I'm being dead serious here never imagine I'm talking about steam while ponder killing my stem stuff but you have a point uh -huh. yeah she's looking a bit better but I still should be careful yeah yeah that's all like a just like a do something like a fun like a 
uh, once in a while basically you don't you don't have to think about like uh, being like uh, this like a fucking uh, angel from heaven to change the world because everything is about not about that like a uh, I think like a I had a also this like in my mind like a some time couple of years ago that a while a year ago or so on that I want to change the world but now that I think about it it's kind of stupid basically because uh, like uh, you can you could do like a uh, much more important things for yourself like uh, ensure your life and basically take care of yourselves like uh, and you you never know what's gonna happen in future anyway somebody gonna fuck it up maybe or it might be like a st go a little bit same like a uh fucking train track or something yeah just enjoy your life like a and do what you want basically you it doesn't have to be like some world changing like idea ideas like a, uh yeah i heard about the girl who died at our linux i woke up uneasy that morning already but hearing of her demise is what made me flip did you know her yes her name was uh, adriana yeah oh yeah that who she was infiltrating she was really good friend of mine God, I'm sorry. Thank you. I'm so sorry. But you know, Adriana started doing what she loved. If not super good, we just pick another threat. It's in our blood. Some people can't stop fighting. I'd rather die in a house than on, on a couch. What a, what a way to burn through, the, through life. Says the one standing on the North Bridge railing. Eh. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I do agree. Like, he also, uh, with Brandis, like, uh, yeah, she, she died, but she died like uh, what she wanted to do, basically. So I guess that, like, uh, was, yeah, that was what, what she wanted to. So, yeah, I mean, well. Yeah, pretty much. You, you, yeah. You don't have to feel like sorry, and I, and for this person who here, yeah, I, he, she, I mean, even though she's like part of Supergirl, there, she's not really like a responsibility. Her death, uh, Adriana knew like a risk, like a what she will involve when she gonna infiltrate him, fucking like a top level in cooperation. It's gonna be like deadly, dead fish. How does a someone end up being? C O O. What is the C O O anyway? Stand for. I mean, in that, what you wanted to be when you were a kid. I wanna know, like, a, I know, I know, I do know what like a CEO what me, what me, what what is like a CEO mean. But I don't remember what C O O. It's a uh, chief operating officer. Holy shit. Okay, so like a. It's like a corporate ex 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 executives who oversees ongoing business operations within the company. Yeah, that's oh, the CEO, COO reports to the CEO, and it and is usually second in command with the company. Okay, yeah, we talk about big top player here. We talking about like a ex like a pretty much like a, on the highest level. <laughs> Almost like a CEO is top there, but this person is like a pretty much close to that one. Holy shit! What a baller! Heh, <laughs> not heh, not uh, at all. I wanted to be a sol soldier. What? You wanted to be a soldier? Really? I can't pick someone as co compassionate as you, killing people on the battlefield. Well, I wanted to be secret agent saving the world in a stealthy, not a lethal way. Wait, hmm, interesting. But when I came to know what actual armies were about, well, I decided to take a fight to the office. Before joining Supercon, I ran my own humanitarian aid company. Huh, that's cool, yeah. What sensed? What do you mean? Why did you join the cooperation game? Or corporate game, because supercontinent is different. 
But we began today, it's just a corrupted version of our most sincere desire to heal society. But I guess I'm proud of most things we did for this city. Yeah, you almost had me full of when you fully dismantled the co corrupt city police. I'm so sorry. How, how have I been this blind? I feel like an idiot for buying into this. I wish you could stop it all. We will, I promise. Ooh, this is... This is like tough. Brandis? Hmm? I think I'm in love with you. Well, that was quick. Whoa, I didn't see that one coming. Yeah, you, you, you tell me. Holy shit. I think I'm all messed up inside. Looking at the waves, the rippling re reflection of the city. I see myself as tiny shadow on the bridge mirrored image. image. I don't know who I am anymore. It doesn't make sense anymore. Life. But then my sense is burning, I can't deny this feeling. And if I'm going to die, why should I deprive myself this last confession of love? I love you, Brandis. Come on, you don't even know who I am. I feel like you're the first human I had honest talk with since I was a kid. Aha, uh -huh. what lame extinct. Uh, yeah, that's... Uh, I guess I should shut up already and jump, huh? Now come with me. You love me too. Not in romantic way. But the hell. But hell. Why not? I love you, Johanna. And now you know a lot of people who you can have honest conversations with every day. We all love your family. The revolutionary lot. Why don't you give your life to us instead of the ocean? I feel like... I feel like we can be better host than those rocking neon waves. Uh, take me with you. Oh, holy shit, that was close one. Brandis is coming back. He's bringing Johanna with me, him. He managed to get her on our side, huh? That's our Brandis. So now one. Hmm? May I ask why you threw Edgar out of the club? Uh, he got mad. I didn't expect you to lose your cool like that. I said Dr. Goldstream is valuable assets for your plans. Surprise, you decided to kick him out into digging more for more information. Uh, that was unprofessional of me, huh? I guess I picked up that from Brandis. Sometimes the right choice isn't the best choice. I may have made our lives harder, but heck, if I didn't make myself happier. No regrets, haha. <laughs> well, that's, that's good for you, Donovan. I love your anxiety levels rising at unpredictable rates. So I determined you made Edgar leave out of self-defense. But it's interesting to know how you justify that use to yourself. It's like, there's no playing it cool with you, huh? What is, what is it? What is it about the mirror neural algorithm that makes you uneasy? If the MNIE gets out, humanity is doomed. Society is about to become an operating system on which corporations will run whatever program they please. They have enough control with media and technology already. What else do they want? What else is there to take from us, huh? I don't mean to discourage you, but the chances of your stopping all this are very, very slow. So in case I ever get to be in charge of MIE. Will you mind answering some question about where to draw the line when they're tuned in social psych welfare? Hey, that's not a bad idea. I'm sort of back up to maintain a sliver of hope for the revolution in case we fail. Let's talk about the primary index of SPV then. How should I regulate depression and anxiety? Don't regulate it. I'll just be depressed. Misery is part of being human. 
Let us need each other. Let us beg for help. Why let people commit in suicide? No, prevent people commit suicide. Many are depressed as they are things we should deal with ourselves. But if an king can keep people from killing themselves, that's good. Their stairs hold, I guess. Yeah, I agree. Now, how about the violence? Should I allow rape to occur? Uh, this is so... Fucking hell, like a... Ah, I hate this, like a, This is so, like, ethical, like a... The questions are all, like, all about ethics, like a, I don't wanna... Yeah, I don't know. Uh, 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 but... Uh... No. So I'd be struggling with it for a long time and never be close to solution. If that may happens to come into effect, at least let rape disappear in the progress. No. I'm not into like censoring any kind of behavior, but if I can save lives, let them arrest murder. Hmm. Uh, <sighs> I don't know, like a. I mean, this is not bad compared to like a murder or raid, like a, those are physical, but these are like a. Mostly like a. Well, like a, and you know what me. Like a plural. Is that what you call it? Like a. Or like a. These are like a. Basically, uh, hate with the word words and so on. They are not as bad like a com like a compared to murder and like a so on. So I guess it can go. Yes, I still trust that some someday humanity will grow out of that. Will I let Bobby remain oppressed? Hmm. No. See, that's a good one. Let the woman be free at least, please. If we fail to stop them, I... Uh, or at least to be able to find comfort in arising sex once and for all. Must point out you are being a bit hypocritical. Why do you say that? You are all, all against the NIE, but don't mind using it particular issues concerning you. Maybe you're just against how they plan to use it. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, I got a mixed point. Like, uh, uh, I don't know. Like, uh, I guess you, I should like, answer like a no to everything. But yeah, that's true. That's true. That's a, like a difficult like a thing to like a decide. Like, a, you like a basic what you want to like erase. In, like, a, yeah, I mean, n you nobody want to see like a murder of rape and hate and. What other was it? Women, women oppress, oppressing, or sexing? But it's like a. Uh, it's hard to say. Like a, if you have an opportunity to erase that all, would you do it? It sounds good on paper, but hmm, yeah, hard to say. Like a, these are like a really huge things. It's hard to like a, be like a blunt about them, but I tried. No, I say it all that just in case we fail to stop it from happening. But you could have told me not affect people at all, and it would be as if you had succeeded. True. What well, is it that you want then? Uh, you made your point, but just to say, as say, I said, if NA becomes operational or right, it happens to get hold of the Mero Neuro Alchemy, I do exactly as you suggest. You know. I got to explain. Experience what I believe was a rush of happiness when you praised me in front of Edgar. Thank you very much, Rowan. I'm glad to hear that. You are wonderful, Akara. Should be proud of yourself. Irwin, you managed to get your hands on your lawyer friend, Naima. Nai. Could have convinced I thought you didn't have it in you to break someone like her. What? You kill at her? What? Oh yeah, we sent that. Mm, now this is bad. Oh yeah, now I completely forgot. 
We sent the fucking guy, the kid basically. Uh, yeah, he was. I think he was under race. The guy basically because uh, the Agara say he had he. She has like a gift for us, and she's, he sent this guy like get one, and we have a Russian roulette, and no, basically, I managed to win, and I got a favor for him. So we, so basically, I sent it to him to like interrogate fucking Naima the lawyer. Oh, and oh, okay, and. So what did she know? Okay, I'll write it down. Uh, I have a Johanna thing covered already. So she didn't know about MIE, huh? Supercontent new CEO is a 15 year old girl named Radhika. Yeah, that surprised me too. But he got like, really had some people killed. Got rid of Jack B. Gaynor, huh? What? Radhika was raised by Akara? Aha, uh -huh, so basically a broad. Rodicky kid put through special cognitive training by an older version of the AI scary. Gonna make her is Dr. Cousin, yeah I know. Okay, that's surprising. Uh let's see how this this going. Eh? So how this gonna affect our now like a story? Oh, we are actually really close to end. Holy shit, I didn't... Okay. Okay. Uh-huh. So the government really is backing Supercontent with SPW. Uh, SPW. We are fucked. All completely legal, I see. Okay, thank you, Irvin. That, that was very useful. So next time, first avoid causing harm, it's cleaner that way for everyone involved. And yeah, most important, it do not fucking kill the target if you weren't in instructed to. Okay, bye. Randis and Johanna are about to come through the door. Well, we kill- we basically were part, part of like a murdering like a fucking- Oh shit. Jesus fucking Christ. Welcome, welcome. Johanna, this is my partner, Donama. Donama, this is Johanna, COO at Supercontra. Welcome to the rest ring club. How are you doing? Fine, thanks a lot, better since you pal here did deactivate Rockwell implant I had in me. Okay, I think I'm gonna. Uh, let's see. Last day, 10 minutes ago. So I hope it saved like a good like a point. So yeah, thank you for watching guys. See you next time. Bye.